guys, uh, my name is Tegan. I'm the piercer here at Bonehead Tattoo. And uh, I guess I'm just going to kind of give you the rundown on what my arm's about. So, um, hot mess. I'm either really, really happy or really, really bummed, so I can't really think of anything that describes me any better than that. Um, I'm a Virgo, so this is a Virgo girl. I'll eventually have a Leo over here. I'm a Leo Virgo. Um, when I first came to California for the very first time, I'm from Kansas, so um, I went to Evangeline's, which was a store, and I fell in love with the flamingos because I used to steal pink flamingos out of people's backyards and then go take them and paint them myself. So when I came here, I saw that, and I was like, no fucking way. Got that. Um, this is probably my favorite right here. It says, uh, it's an Aquanet hairspray can bottle. It's for my mom. It says, Strength, Beauty, Brains, established uh, 1963. It's when my mom was born. Um, we cannot leave the house without having our hair did or makeup done, like, like, in the most dire situations. Like, we have to have, we have to look good. So, um, my family's been into antiques my whole life. Uh, when I was a little girl, my grandma took me to this other antique store where they had a, a tiger carousel. And, um, so I got this for my grandma. My mom's favorite animal is an elephant. Um, the trunk has to be up to hold the good luck. Um, she collects those as well, so that's for my mom. This is uh, for my little sister. She loves zebras. Um, it's a work in progress, these three are, but we're getting there. Um, I got this back when I was 18. Um, I did a lot of art in school ever since I was a little girl, up until college. I'm a college dropout. What up? <laughs> <laughs> um, so yeah, I'm an artist, just a little self-portrait. She needs a little touch-up. Um, let's see what else we got. My friend Peaches was getting a job at this shop and needed to do a piece on someone real quick, so we threw that one on there. Have a little cupcake, right above my little coffee tattoo. And uh, this was my very first one when I was 17 years old. Oh. Um, yeah, so, um, and he put the stencil on, and then he's like, you're not going to understand what I'm doing, but just watch. So he took the machine and um, didn't dip it in any ink or anything, and just, with my blood, like, in the machine, just made bloodlines. Um, so I thought that was fascinating that he was making art with my just my blood. So I kept that as a theme throughout my whole entire arm because that was literally the first thing I ever got done was no ink, just the machine and my blood, bloodline. Um, I've been fascinated ever since and I've been watching every single tattoo that I get done. Is that popcorn? That is popcorn. <laughs> I wanted to stick along with the carnival, like kind of a carnival theme. Oh, I love so that. So got, we got little popcorns, we got some... Creepy little snow cones. I got some cotton candies around here, somewhere in there too. I drew this little guy. That little guy's all me. <laughs> it looks a little creepy and cute, just the way I like it. So that's about it for my arm. Alright. Okay, I don't know what to say, but we'll wing it. <laughs> yeah, of course. Um, so I got this one too. I get a lot of compliments. Um, the most the most frequently asked question about this one is, is it real? And I have to ask myself, are they talking about my boobs or my tattoos? <laughs> <laughs> it's so funny. I always think, I'm like, of course my tattoos are real. And then some bum asking me if my tits are real. It's all about. Anyways, <laughs> um, it says love is hell. Um, move your hair, move your hair. Cool. Um, my dad, my dad's always been uh, tattooed ever since I was a little girl. Yeah. So whenever... Um, the one thing I really did learn from him, without it being his mistakes, was uh, love is blind, but your neighbors ain't, and it's something that's always been true, so I'm like, so yeah, I'm a, got some issues there, but that one obviously enough to get love is held out dude across my chest, but whatever, you know. Um, my back piece is probably my favorite, though, so I'll show you that one. It says, sink or swim. Um, back home. I'm from Kansas, so back home, um, the people I was running around with, they were really into drugs and partying and, like, just doing too much. So I was, like, getting a half gallon every night, like, got a 30% off discount at the liquor store before I was even 21, you know? Um, so I was, everyone was just doing too much, but I'm younger than all of them, and they all are still, like, having bad drug problems and shit and haven't really got out of it, and it's really sad, but... You could literally like do anything that you want. Like if you put your mind to it, you can get out of that. Like so, sink yeah. or swim is that like death or glory? Um, it's more or less like if you want if you want something bad enough, like 
it's so easy to stay in the life that you're living, you know what I mean? Like, you could you stay in the drugs, stay in the booze, but nothing is going to come of your life. Like, you you can't make anything of yourself if you're doing that to yourself. So I literally, I went to rehab, I have an alcohol problem. Um, three weeks clean yesterday. <laughs> um, you know, but there's def definitely... Um, no, trials that's great. and tribulations that's that you have to go through, you know. Yeah. Um, but I moved to California. I got out of that, you know. I'm, and you're accomplishing a lot here. I'm trying. I just uh, want to make something of myself, you know. Like you already are special. something. Well, that that's exciting. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. I got uh, my tattoo in there too. You did. Good yeah, job. Good the job. Arm part, yeah. Like, yeah. Uh -huh. yeah. Oh yeah. Oh uh, hey, like. Like, what's up, girl? What are you doing? Sneak oh, by the way, yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> sneak attack. Yeah. Um, I don't know which other ones. Oh. I drew this one too. It needs oh. a touch up. <laughs> but this is another one I drew. Oh wait. I so you're, you draw really good. Oh wow. thank you. Um, wow. I want to get back into it more than like when I was in school I was into it like hardcore. And moving here to California I just kind of been overwhelmed and but art is something I definitely want to get back into. I drew that little guy. It's not a My Little Pony and it's definitely not a horse. It's a fucking black sheep. <laughs> I'm like, what do you see when you look at it? Because I drew it, you know, and everyone's like, uh, My Little Pony? I'm like, so bad. It's not My Little Pony, it's a black sheep. Because I'm a black sheep. Oh. <laughs> I got my diamonds. You got diamonds? Yeah. Oh, cool. Where those come from? <laughs> uh, I don't know where. Um, got those back in Kansas. They definitely need touched up. Um, I... Definitely got a lot of apprentice work. <laughs> well, oh, okay, what what kind of like do you have any more big plans like as far as like huge pieces go? Uh yeah. Um like I said I'm kind of I'm kind of fascinated with like the balance between good and evil, you know? Mm -hmm. So um this as you can see is nothing but color and I love color. Um but since I'm from Kansas I'm gonna get um the return to Oz sleeve. It's all darker. So um this is all gonna be I have it all planned out like Wicked Witch, all the evil flying monkeys. Uh, I'm debating Wizard of Oz or the Return to Oz. I don't know. I've got time to think of it. I'm 22 and I got a decent amount. I got some time. So, yeah. um, and then eventually, there's a Sailor Jerry tattoo where there are these two panthers and it's like a mirror image of each other. They're facing each other. But I'm gonna get them um, on my throat. But we're gonna redo it and they're gonna be cheetahs. And um, this one will be half alive, this one will be dead, and then where their mouths come together will leave like a heart of negative space, like right here, right, right in there somewhere. I somewhere. can see it already. I think yes. you're, you're scratching your skin. I'm like, oh. yeah. <laughs> I like petting myself, just like, oh. <laughs> um, but the most important one, um, I want to get my grandma and grandpa's wedding portrait in an antique picture frame. It's beautiful, like. I love it. A lot of people are like, well, why don't you just do that? The, their faces and stuff. And I was like, I want the whole thing. Like, my grandpa's holding my grandma's arm and they're cutting the cake together. You know, super, super uh, meaningful to me. My grandpa passed and my grandma's still, you know, she's still alive. And it's something that, like, my, like they're, they were kind of conservative, but I'm the wild child and the black sheep. So I'm an only kid. And so they see me trying to do something with myself. So they don't really care what I do anymore. They, they like look at it a different way. You know, mm -hmm. it feels good to like kind of open their eyes a little bit to this is what's happening now. This is how I like to express myself. You know, they're from the old school. What do they think about school. you? Like, well, first off, they're from Kansas. They go to church every Sunday. <laughs> you know, yeah. my mom used to make me tuck my little septum when I had it. And my grandma's like, I don't care. You know, yeah. uh, my grandma showed me, um, a photo of her when she was my age and she was like I was 21 years old and I weighed uh, 118 pounds and she was like in a white like in a one-piece bathing suit just looking gorgeous like against a white picket fence and that's really what kind of opened my eyes to like any kind of pinup modeling. I started pinup and then I got more into alternative and just um, doing what makes me happy really and making a lot of good friends along the way so. <laughs> I don't know what else <laughs> to say. <laughs> Still going? Do you want me to do anything? <laughs> what do you want me to do? <laughs> I'm just kidding. <laughs> I wish I had all the ones I was wanting though. 
like right now. Just like have them on me. Oh, I have Pegasus Beauty on this one too with my gnarly scar. 